In this video, we'll be looking at section 3.2. Graphing using X and Y intercepts. Graphing using X and Y intercepts. And our essential question will be, how do I graph using x and y intercepts? So the first thing we'll need is to know what an x and y intercept is. So an x-intercept is where the graph crosses the x-axis. So the x-intercept is where the graph crosses the x-axis. And the y-intercept is where the graph crosses the y-axis. So the y-intercept is where the graph crosses the y-axis. X-intercept, we're crossing the x-axis. Y-intercept, we're crossing the y-axis. Okay, so this now we can do an example. So the first step is to build a table. So let's see, I'm graphing four x plus two y equals eight. I'm going to build the table. So I'm going to build a table, and we're going to be build a table using x equals zero and y equals zero. So the table won't be given to us. We have to actually draw the table ourselves. So I will draw a table, and I have my x and my y. I'm going to use x equals zero, and I'll use y equals zero. <coughs> So we're only going to try to find two values. We're going to plug in x equals 0 and find a y. Then we'll plug in y equals 0 and find an x. So let's do that. <clears throat> so we're going to find the y value when x equals 0. So 4 times 0. Make these colors match. plus 2y equals 8. So I just plugged in x equals 0, and now we're going to simplify and we're going to solve for y. So we'll go 4 times 0 is 0, plus 2y equals 8. The 0 kind of goes away, so we don't need that anymore. So all we have to do now is divide by 2, and we get y equals 4. So when x is 0, <coughs> y is 4. And now we'll do the same exact idea, but instead of x equaling 0, we're going to have y equals 0. So now I'm going to have 4x plus 2 times Four x plus two times zero equals eight. 
So the 2 times 0 kind of cancels out, and we have 4x equals 8. We divide both sides by 4, and we get x equals 2. <clears throat> so now we have our two points. We have the point 0, 4, and we have the point 2, 0. And now we're ready to graph. So we'll plot the points and connect the dots. And then we'll connect the dots to create a line. So I'll draw my XY plane. Labeling my axes. And my first point was zero, 04. So there's no left or right movement, no movement on the X, staying at zero, and then we'll go up four. One, two, three, four. So zero, comma, four. And then we'll plot our <coughs> Y intercept, or our X intercept, two, comma, zero. So we'll go over two. And then zero, so there's no movement up or down. We'll put that point. Like so. Then we connect the dots. Like so. And all I want to do, the last thing I want to do is label each intercept. So this one is our Y intercept. It's crossing the Y axis. And this one right here is our x-intercept. Like so. And that's how we can graph lines using x and y intercepts. Well, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you have a great rest of your day.